As you all know that we have started a series in which we are covering 50 states. Last time we talked about different topics in Alaska, like warning the Alaskans that a new scam is coming, the customer's complaints, and the benefits of getting the insurance. So this is the second part of that series, in which I am going to Alabama, the heart of Dixie, insurance. So, without wasting time, let's start with Bama facts. Alabama is the 30th largest by area and 24th most populous the American state, with a total of 1,500 miles of inland waterways. As of 2020, the population of Alabama was more than 5 million, an increase of 244,543 or 5.12% since the 2010 consensus. This comprises a natural increase of 121,054,818 and a total migration of 104,991 people into the state. Migration from outside America resulted in a total increase of 31,180, and relocation within the country produced an increase of 73,811. All Alabama naturalists agree that outstate agree that our state has an extraordinarily rich diversity of animal and plant life. The number of documented butterfly species rivals and surpasses that of most states. Alabama's great biodiversity is due largely to its wide diversity of geology and moderates to a warm climate. All of the land diversity is drained by various river systems, with the massive Tennessee River flowing through the northern one-fifth of the state. According to the estimation of demographers, a minimum of 20 to 23 percent of people in Alabama are of predominantly English ancestry, and state that the figure might be higher than that. The largest reported ancestry groups in Alabama are Americans, 13.4 percent, Irish, 10.5 percent, English, 10.2 percent, German, 7.9 percent, and Scots-Irish, 2.5 percent, according to data from the 2008 consensus. The other non-English languages spoken in Alabama are Spanish, German, and French. About 86% of Alabama's population is Christians, including 6% Catholic, with 11% having no religion. The composition of other civilizations is 0.5% Mormon, 0.5% Muslims, and 0.5% Hindus. Now let's talk about the economy of Alabama. Alabama Crimson Tide football is the number in the industry. Agriculture plays a major part in the economy, such as cash crop cotton. Alabama ranks between 8th and 10th in national cotton production, according to numerous reports. Alabama's industrial outputs comprise iron and steel products. The major complaints of consumers related to insurance were about how claims are handled. Across all the insurers, 68% of all complaints were related to claims handling, the second most common issue that the consumers are facing is the delay of claims and there about 834 complaints have been received in this regard. 6 Tips of Insurance Your insurance needs will vary based on a number of factors, including your industry, your specialty, and your assets. So you can choose your plans accordingly. While price should be a consideration when buying insurance, it should not be the only one. The old saying is, you acquire what you pay for. There are a few reasons why price differs between insurance carriers. A lower price means you have low coverage and vice versa. Don't forget to give your details like your name, address, DOB, social security number, and phone number. Depending on the type of insurance you are considering, there are many ways to reduce the cost, such as multiple policies, safety equipment, long-time policy, and higher deductibles, which means a lower premium. You should only deal with licensed insurance producers who work for companies licensed to sell insurance in Alabama. When considering life insurance, one rule of thumb is to purchase life insurance that is equal to five to seven times your annual gross income. If you want to get the best insurance policy, then you can contact P. Milley Endurance which covers all types of insurance, such as whole, universal, and term. Our website is connected to all the top companies with one click away instead of searching for the website. You can contact us anytime for an appointment just by clicking the link below.